So, yeah, we have a guest joining us right now from uh, King Bandit. Is that you? Yes, what I'm doing. Oh, hey. <laughs> King Bandit, first of all, thank you so much for talking with us. Uh, really appreciate it before you uh, perform tonight. Are you excited to perform and get this party started? Yes, I'm always excited. Always. Where, where are you? Right now I'm in Louisville, Kentucky. This one I'm from. Oh, okay. Okay, so you're coming to us from Kentucky tonight. Did you? Were you born and raised there? Yes, ma'am. All right, very. I good. can hear that that southern accent. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been here before to Atlanta, but yeah, that's where I'm at most of the time. Oh. So, well, how, what inspired you to to get into music and and uh, this industry? Man, a lot of my uncles and big brothers and cousins and all of my a lot of my family do music. So, I don't know. I've been doing it for a long time. I guess just the hustle, the money that it brings. So it's in your DNA, essentially, in music, right? <laughs> yeah, I recorded my first song when I was like five or so. What? <laughs> wow. Okay. That's so impressive. You were now, born to do this. <laughs> Now, yeah. could you explain to me, uh, we were having a conversation about this earlier. I know that at Atlanta is like, is the hub of uh, trap, gangster rap. And, um, and I, I have always wondered like, what does trap mean? Like, how is that different from the type of rap that we've grown used to over the years that you hear on the radio? Trap just more of a different sound. It's more of people talking about what's going on in the communities that we got and how they making the money that they making. And I guess the old school rap is more of people like battling and spitting lyrics and trying mm -hmm. like, I don't know. It's just a whole different vibe. Man. Well, is it yes, more of a social commentary trap? Like, are you you're talking about the conditions people are living in and yeah, what's happening more, in the world? Yeah, it's more of like that than like hip hop. I guess it used to just be based around different stuff than what it is now. Mm -hmm. it's the kind of people that's making it into the industry that come from different situations. But you know, the East Coast, West Coast, old school rap. You know, they. It may have sounded different, and please feel free to disagree, but I feel like they still, in their way, um, addressed social issues uh, in their music and yeah. in their artistry, much mm -hmm. like, I mean, and much hasn't changed for the rap. Yeah, community. and that's why I said it's just more of like a, a new sound. It's just like a new trap sound is what they go by, that's the word, but mm -hmm. they don't always still be hip hop. Okay, so what are you planning to do tonight? I mean, what are we? Ex what can we expect to hear? I got a new single called "Wet Them Up." The video is out right now. The song's out on all major platforms, and we just turning up tonight, bringing the vibe to everybody who's gonna be participating. Man, we're working on a "Make the News" EP that's on the way, and I got an intro to "Make the News" inside now on all platforms, and the video out on YouTube too. Oh, I want to see the video. We can just yeah. go to YouTube and, and look it up. Yes, ma'am. Just search King Bandit. Make the news. But what I like, so is, it's, did you say making news or making moves? It's making news. <laughs> because I, I really, I, I think that's a, a perfect transition to ask because I like to ask really young people like yourself, um, especially in the climate that we're in right now with the craziness going on mm -hmm. in the uh, political world and in our news. How, how do you guys and people, uh, you, your friends and people uh, in your age group feel about what you're seeing right now with the media and politics? I just feel like it's all a distraction. Everything is just, I just try to stay focused on me and what I got going. It's just all a big distraction. I don't really get into the news and what everybody's saying because they only put out what they want people to know. Mm -hmm. So you, you're you distrustful of what you see on the news? Yeah, basically. 
most of it anyway. I don't believe most of what I see. I don't I don't you never know. They always switching up their stories and saying different mm -hmm. stuff. So. Have you ever had an experience where you were watching the news or reading the newspaper and what you saw there you you knew just wasn't quite right? Like Yeah, they it, they had they had a, a a thirteen year old boy that had got shot or something in the same place where I, I had had an incident and they had me on the news board while I was incarcerated for something totally different. So that was fake news. Right? Mm -hmm. Wow, this, I see. Yeah, there's people that, that that boy's family probably wanted to harm me or do things to me while I'm locked up and cross-rated over fake news. Like, That's terrible. Right, so you you have been the subject of uh, fake news yourself, so you, you've experienced it and felt, uh, I'm sure, some certain emotions about that. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I wanted to let you know, uh, uh, King Bandit, you know, we're all excited to see you perform tonight. And I know you said that you have um, your content on all social media platforms, but I'm curious what you think of the Zap Life platform and, and what you've gotten to know about it so far. Yeah, what, you, what drew you to Zap Life? Well, I seen it on a post from Jim Jones, but I actually like the app because it's something to do with all the quarantine going on and people can't really link up and go mm -hmm. out to clubs. So, and it's like, it's a, it's a new platform for artists to get their music out there and to deal with different artists and in the industry and get their songs heard by a bigger audience than they already have. I mean, it must be weird for you. I mean, obviously you've performed in clubs and in front of people and to have this long period now where you you can't do it you know if that if that's what's in your blood what you enjoy doing it mu it must be so frustrating that you just can't get out there and and do what you love exactly and that's why the zap life app is powerful because that's where they come in now so tell me something what is your voting plan did you did, did have you voted i I, you know, a lot of people have already gotten out there, and Tuesday's the last day. I'm a convicted felon. I can't vote. So, uh -huh. Well, uh, I know there are organizations and people fighting to change that. Mm -hmm. um, so hopefully, at some point, you will be able to in the future, if you choose to. Uh, it would be your choice, but I know that there are organizations working to do that, and I hope that is part of your future if that is something you choose to do mm -hmm. but yeah. i will say that i i think it's it's awesome that you've chosen to express yourself with your talents of music mm -hmm. and rapping and i also want to let you know that our interview that we're having right now we're going to put together in a, a way that uh, you can share it with your fans and people who follow you on all your social media platforms mm -hmm. So if they weren't able to make your performance tonight on Zap Life, uh, or at least this interview uh, before your performance, we'll put it together for you and be able to uh, send it out to everyone so everyone can at least see your interview with us and maybe ask about Zap Life too. Right. Check it out. Make sure yeah, you cool. check it out and tell your fans to check it out at Ovis.news. Ovis.news for show. Well, awesome. Thank you. King so Bandit. nice to meet you, King Bandit. Yeah, thank you. I hope you. you kill it tonight. You're young nice. and, and you have a long future ahead of you. So best of luck to you. And I hope you find a lot of success. All right. Thank you. I think that jewelry would look good with my outfit I, tonight. I like that. Right? That looks so nice. I was, I've was i been staring at that I'm going to have to borrow that, King Bandit. <laughs> nice. I know. It's quite fancy. I like that a lot.